All right, I'm going to do uh, another quick video. It's been a little bit since I've done one, but I was able to get uh, 1070 Ti, so I wanted to see, uh, you know, how that performed mining. Um, I also just went ahead and bought a 1080 and a 1070 as well. Uh, the 1070 is in the middle, actually. 1070 Ti is this one right here, and I will show you. I'm running nice hash. Um, but yeah, so this is uh, my second mining rig. Uh, I have PCIe slots coming later where I'll kind of uh, take them off of the motherboard because as you can see, maybe, I don't, you probably can't tell, but the board's actually bending under the weight of, under this uh, 1080 Duke. Um, but, uh, so I want to definitely want to uh, alleviate some of the pressure off of that. So let's go ahead and see what we got here. Take that off, take that off. So the 1070, okay. It's just the 1070 running. Um, so far it seems, um, it seems really good for mining. I mean, I could be wrong, uh, but it seems, and I got the cheaper one. I got the, the Zotac Mini, I think it was a Mini, or maybe it was just a regular 1070 Ti, but it was, it's more of the smaller one, so. Um, but yeah, so that's making uh, over two dollars a day, but on its own, which is pretty outstanding. Um, I mean, that's current rates. Uh, Bitcoin did go was all the way up to seventy nine hundred earlier today, uh, but now I think it's trading around seventy four. Um, but what makes it really good is it's really good for undervolting. You can drop the power limit to eighty percent and the memory clock up really high, and it runs so cold. It runs at fifty two C which is incredible because uh, I think the 1080 is running at like 77. So the colder you can run it, uh, you know, usually the better it is. You're using less power. Uh, and so, so, so far, um, I didn't try testing it for gaming or anything like that, but for mining, it seems to be possibly one of the best ones that I, cards that I have. Um, it, it was $450, so it's going to take a while to get your return on investment but i don't think it's gonna take too long especially with the way the bitcoin price has just been shooting up but if you have any questions about it you want me to run any benchmarks on uh different coins specific coins or um if you want me to test it on gaming or anything like that i'd be happy to do that um but here's what it's getting in the lira uh algorithm and it's doing pretty good I, I like it i'm happy with it 44 mega hashes i could probably boost it a little bit more if i want to put the core clocks up and the memory clocks i didn't push it to its limit uh, it just seems to be doing pretty well like where it's at right now uh, i might do that a little bit later but all right thanks for watching guys